Today we have a short troubleshooting video for users of Pro Tools 12 on Windows system. So say you come over here to launch Pro Tools 12 and you notice that it's taking quite a long time to boot up. We can see here it's just staying on initializing databases. You know, it should be much faster than this. What is going on? Or maybe you get Pro Tools completely launched and it seems really laggy and unresponsive. Well, here is the possible problem. So as you can see, Pro Tools has hung. So first we need to close out Pro Tools. Now this may be a chore. You may need to just restart your system. After we've closed out Pro Tools, let's check over here in my CD DVD drive. And you'll notice that I have a DVD in my drive. And that is actually what was causing the problem. And this is really easy to look over. Maybe you were watching a movie. Maybe you were listening to music. Or maybe you were uh, installing a program and you just left your CD or DVD in the drive. Then you went to start up Pro Tools and you notice really laggy behavior of Pro Tools. Well, the solution is remove that CD or DVD from your drive before launching Pro Tools. So I'll remove this DVD from our drive. Go ahead and close the drive back up. And now that we've removed the disk from our drive, we'll relaunch Pro Tools 12. And we should see much, much quicker performance. So as you can see, it's running right through my plugins, loading them right up. And this is real time, by the way. And right there we are. I'll go ahead and open my session. And now we can go ahead and create our tracks and start recording in Pro Tools. Now this is mentioned within the Pro Tools 12 README for Windows, so be sure to check that out and the other possible causes of slow performance of Pro Tools. So just remember to remove any disks from your CD or DVD drive before launching Pro Tools.